All right, time now for this amazing group that features Matt Hagen in lane one. That's the Mopar car. John Force. Apparently, he's won 16 championships. That's a big deal. Robert Hyde, his teammate, the president of the organization in lane three. And Tommy Johnson Jr. and Terry Chandler just making wishes come true for kids across the nation. Time now for the sounds of the strip. 40 thou coming to life. So turn it up. His teammate, Robert Height, will join him in the finals. Dickie Venables is stunned, as is Don Schumacher. Both Schumacher racing cars in lanes one and four are done, and Don has had it. That said it all. You saw Don Schumacher, a team force beats Team Schumacher here. Both force cars of Don and Robert advance, and the two Don Schumacher racing cars of Matt Hagen and Tommy Johnson Jr. are done for the weekend. A lot of drama here determining who's going to be alongside Alexis LaGioria and Tim Wilkerson. You're going to a final, and obviously you're making big strides. Yeah. Tell us about your success. Well, just learning how to run my car. It's the same deal every year. We don't get to test, so get all this new junk in a pile, and we try to figure out how to run it. It always takes me four or five races to catch on, but uh, I'd like to know what lane choice is. I don't even know that. I'm freaked out about that because I don't know if it's going to make any difference because it looks like all the lanes are pretty good, but uh, happy to be in the finals for Ford Summit Racing and Levi Rand Shop. Boy, without Levi, I couldn't do this. So thank you, Dick Levi. We're going to try and make you proud, brother. Go get it ready. Thank you. Big winless streak, too, for Tim Wilkerson. You got to go back to Seattle 2011. Streak that stands at 59 races, but Tim Wilkerson will have a shot to win the four wide nationals along with the teammates, height and force, but it's going to be Alexis Lane Choice in her hands as she goes after her third Wally of the early 2014 season. Stack and, and think about this, 12 races in a row starting at the Big O. John Force Racing has had one or maybe in some cases two cars in the final round in Funny Car. They are on a roll. Wow, yes they are. Back in Sean Langdon's pit, going to be looking at that steering wheel issue. I guarantee that, but for the men, the work on this car, they've already descended upon it. They're stripping it down, Mike, to build it back up. 